Facebook group have this feature where they can group all the important topics, important chapter, important posts that you want to put in terms of like a guide. The, they call it Facebook group guides. Now I have a video previously on Facebook group guides as well. So it's a very good place where you can sort everything to a certain chapter then people will go through it. When they go in the group, they know, oh, this is guide number one, number two, number three, and then they can watch it one by one. But there are some changes compared to the previous video that I have, like the way you post and what's inside there. And this is the updated video for it. Okay, now before I continue, if you're new to this channel, subscribe to this channel so they can get more tips on digital marketing. Without further ado, let me jump into my computer and let me show you how you can navigate around this Facebook guide. All right, so first of all, go to your Facebook profile in your computer, facebook.com. Okay, where do you find your groups? So you can see suggested there'll be groups here or usually they'll be just down here in your shortcut or you can just click on the nine dots click on groups just click on it and then you can see here the groups that you manage just click on the lead generation for business for example this is the group that I created so first of all we need to enable learning uh, which is where the guides are in so you can see the guides are not here so you can scroll all the way down you can see group settings just click on group settings scroll down you can see here add features just click on add features then you need to add the set of guides click here we just add the whole thing here adding okay and guide is automatically here it became available click on settings and then it is on okay go to your facebook group again and you can see the word guides here and then how you add guides click on guides so guides is where for example you can put in that different chapter and then you can see uh, this is a session to highlight important posts you want people to read so basically put it in terms of chapter like i mentioned just now help people learn about specific topics that if you are doing trainings right let's just click start the guide and then for example Okay, so this is for example, you just click save and then the guide is here. Okay, one big difference if you notice compared to my old video is that to enable guide, it is not at the same place as where it was previously. It is still in group settings, but they show it very big, very prominently now with that nice icon. Another thing is that you can create any post or any quizzes inside here. I have no idea why they removed this, why Facebook removed this. And I find it a bit irritating as well. So you can see that you can't actually post anything inside here. Okay, so how do you add post inside here? So you will have to post something here first. Okay, just for example, that's, that's something like this. If you have a video or picture, you can add it in. You can just click on here. Sometimes it'd be good to have video explanation. So if you have a lot of video, you just put it in the post first, then only you send to guide. Let me show you how. Click on post. So you can put a different schedule as well if you want to. Just click post. Now, for example, it is here right now, right? All I have to do is click on the three dots. So now this is to put the post into guides. Click on the three dots. And you can see here, add post to guide. Just click on it. So you can put different guides that you want to. I want to just put one, title. Just click save. And this will go inside here and then once you're done you just click on done and then you can show the one by one post completed if you have more then you have more so yeah this is a bit different from the previous video where you can immediately create the post inside the guide itself and now they don't allow it there's they don't even have quizzes i was looking all over for the quiz but i can't find it there's only polls so basically whatever you can do inside here is only here you can have poll you can have reels you have photo videos but you won't see anything other than that so this is uh, i think it's a downgrade from what they have previously but oh well i saw somebody commented in my YouTube a video on a previous YouTube video that they can't create posts there anymore. So this is what you can do. All right. And of course, you need to be the admin to do this. And I hope this is helpful for you, especially if you are having trouble. So this is not your fault. It's not our fault. This is what Facebook or Meta decided to do. So don't have to beat yourself to it and just do what you can uh, with what you have. Uh, I know sometimes we want to do a lot of things in Facebook or in Instagram. I have the feeling that I want to do a lot, lot of things, but we have to work within the limitation that's the reason why we have a lot of different outside platform out there like system.io or ghl all is to mitigate all these kinds of kind of issue uh, or to bring people out so that we can give different value through different methods instead of using facebook because i've noticed there's quite a lot of challenging thing on facebook not only our guides not only our groups but many different things as well there's limitation uh, so i guess just be aware